Bail is set at half a million dollars for the man suspected of trying to kidnap a barista at a coffee stand in Auburn. Now, this terrifying act was captured on surveillance video, still circulating on social media, even making national headlines. Fox 13's Frankie Thompson has the latest on the suspect's hearing. Auburn police have now identified the attempted kidnapping suspect as Matthew Darnell. Here at the courthouse, we learned he is a business owner who lives with his parents in Auburn. Court documents say Auburn police found a looped zip tie under the seat of his pickup truck when he was arrested. King County prosecutors claim this man, at six feet tall, 300 pounds, intended to kidnap a barista, just five feet two, 110 pounds. They say she was working alone at a coffee stand in Auburn. The fact that he tried to capture a teen young woman from a bikini barista stand was wearing bikini top and short skirt. Strong suggests that this was sexually motivated. Surveillance video shows the suspect at a drive through coffee stand trying to yank a barista out of a window with a looped zip tie in his hand. The woman pulled her arm away and slam the window closed. What's really striking about this video is is how brazen it is. And I think the public looks at this and says, oh my God, could that happen to me or, or my daughter or someone I love? And also wants to know that the prosecutor's office is doing something about it. And King County prosecutors are. We're acting on this immediately. The prosecutor's office says the suspect is now facing charges of attempted kidnapping with a finding of sexual motivation and assault in the first degree. Judge Rebecca Robertson says she finds probable cause in this case. And then that gives police investigators three total days to get the investigation to us for formal charges. Auburn police say the suspect drove away in a Chevy Silverado pickup truck, but not before cameras captured a shot of his tattoo, what appears to say Chevrolet, resembling the tattoo on this man's left arm. This tip is what investigators say circulated all over social media, tracing the man and his pickup truck back to his home where he was arrested. Auburn police, we appreciate their work on this one because this is you know, we all saw that video and it's it's terrifying and we appreciate the good quick work that Auburn police have done on this case. A sexual assault protection order was also issued against Darnell. He is scheduled for his next court hearing tomorrow at 2.30. Reporting in Seattle, Frankie Thompson, Fox 13 News.